Hello my friends, my name is Dadcraft73 and welcome back to another episode of our Chicken Blocked Let's Play series. Oh man, I hope you're having a good day. I hope you're taking care of yourself and you're doing all right. That is for sure and for certain. Listen, we got some chicken stuff going on around here. The fire chicken, he makes me a little nervous. That's right, we got the fire chicken and we've got the blackstone chicken. And uh, we have uh, these. There we go. Now, the, uh, the, the fire chicken came from a sand chicken egg. I guess that's the deal, right? Like, sometimes we don't know what we're going to get. You don't know what you got till it's good. That's, a diff that's not the right song. <laughs> anyway, let's uh, turn the... Uh, I have some seeds right there. Did I break one of those? Uh, yes. That's why I have an extra seed. Put that back there. Oh, man, that's not good. Uh, okay, whatever. It's fine. Let's sleep through the night. We're going to try to breed this blackstone chicken and this fire uh, fire chicken and see if we get anything. I mean, it sounds like uh, we might get something cool. It's kind of like a nether... Ne oh, uh, okay. He doesn't, he doesn't like seeds, I guess. Okay, well, there you have it. Okay, that doesn't work. <laughs> All right. So today, uh, we've got to get ourselves this little spawning area taken care of. And we really don't have that many resources. Uh, but we're going to, I guess, tear down the majority of our stuff here. Uh, I don't know. Let's see, I don't know how many. There's, it's, it's 49, 7 by 7 out there. So I'm not sure exactly how we're going to get any more... Um, uh, dirt, but that's what our goal is. I mean, I guess we could let's let's actually do something really quick before we do any of that stuff. Let's uh, get a chest going. We also, I, I I'm gonna have to move the chicken pen. Uh, I don't really have the dirt to be moving other stuff around. There, put this chest down. I'll put it down right here, and then we'll put all of these things in here really quick. We're gonna go over to the ship and sneak around over there and see if we can't find anything. Uh, somebody has, uh, so you guys were saying that there might be some goodies over there. Uh, so let's go and see if we can't do a little bit of a, a ship exploration and start raking in all the goods. All right, we're going to do that. We'll do this right here. Here we are. Okay, there's a chest there. That's just filled with books. Beginner's guide. This is a beginner's guide. Oh, I think we might. We should probably get that book. Let's bring that with us. What's this over here? Uh, chicken block starter. Okay, we'll grab that too. All right, we'll grab both of those. Are there any chests looking stuff around here? Doesn't appear to be. All right. Let's not spend too much time looking around, but let's just give it a good once over and see if we can find any goodies. We kind of look. There's lots of barrels and stuff, right? So maybe we can find something. Let's go back here. There's our chicken. Fire chicken, creeper chicken, zombie chicken, corrupted chicken. We have to get those yet. Oh, my goodness. Lucky block chicken. All right. I mean, we'll get them all. Gotta catch them all. It's like Pokemon around here. All right, let's go down. Uh, what's this? Ch that's the chicken counter. Okay. There's some stuff over here. Wow, it keeps going down. Whoa, look at this place. Ah, it's pretty cool down here. There's another portal thing. All right, these are all the different... Man, we even get these kinds? A wannabe chicken? A wannabe warden. Oh, I see. This is uh, the real deal down here in the old chicken-blocked world. Okay, uh, let's see. Can we go outside, maybe? Yeah, let's go up this way. We've got on the deck and go snooping around. There's nothing in there. Let's look at all of these barrels really quick. I don't see anything in them. Okay, there's a bookcase. That's super cool stuff. Uh, there's a spyglass. Can we have the spyglass? That might be kind of cool. Can we snatch that? I guess we can't have, we can just turn it. Okay. I mean, that's cool if that's how they're going to be. All right, nothing in there. This is the loom. That's uh, the big things. There's a slime there. There's nothing in any of these barrels. All right. I feel like we're getting kind of scammed a little bit. Can we have this stuff? Like, can I have this? Uh, there's a string right there. What's this? Just a barrel. Can I have any of these items? Or do I have to break these? Okay, I can't break any of that stuff. I thought I was going to be able to take that. Hmm. All right. Okay, nothing in any of those. Yes, yeah, so I think maybe I got scammed a little bit. Somebody was like, yeah, there's lots of stuff here on the thing. You can go. Get oh, oh, there's a chicken, a chicken net and a wool chicken egg. Okay, that's nice. And some beetroot seeds. Let's take all this stuff with us. There's your chicken net. That's pretty cool. All right, that's our first little set of goodies. All right, no goodies there. That's a crafting bench. 
That's uh, uh, that stuff. Okay. All right, well, there we go. Whoa, that's a pretty cool looking ship, though. I'm 100% down with that thing. That's awesome looking. Man, people like pros build that. All right, well, I mean, we got some goodies. We're a little bit on the hungry side. All right, let's head back, and then we're going to read. Let's just look around here one more time. Do we see anything else? All right, we at least got some things. Let's um, get. Let's go down through the portal, and we'll head back. And then we can eat a little something, and then we'll read our book. We did get some beetroot seeds. I'm not sure exactly why we need beetroots, but... You know, we can do it. Welcome. So, 80 chickens. Yeah, yeah, yeah. These, that's... Okay. Okay, these talk about nets. Yeah, we read all this stuff. Okay. And then what is this? The Beginner's Guide. Does this say pretty much the same thing? This handle got a few mechanics. Okay. Uh, chickens now drop eggs when you breed them instead of baby chickens. Uh, you'll need an incubator. Okay. Chicken nets are a great way to move chickens around easily while whilst holding a net. Just simply hit a chicken and it'll scoop it up. You'll be able to place it down in another location or store them away safely. The incubator. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We know about that. New recipes items. There are new recipes to figure out. Um, it's in the crafting menu for you to explore. Ticket to ride. Okay. Yeah. Oh, what? Oh, you can make a new one. Okay, with dirt. Yep. You must uh, unlock new islands. To unlock, you must discover new chicken eggs. Okay. Okay. You can purchase more hints and stuff. Okay. I mean, so at least that, that, that gave us a little bit of, I guess, more heads-up type information. All right. So we could take some chickens out of here if we wanted to. Oh, let's uh, get this uh, guy really quick. All right, so we have lots of, uh, let's eat some food, and then uh, I'm gonna try to tear this down. So what I wanna do is I wanna move as much dirt as I possibly can. The other thing I think I'm gonna do, do I have, I do. All right, let's get these in our on our bar. Let's get these seeds down here like so. And let's con all these chickens into coming over here. Come over here, chickens, come on. Don't oh, you wanna come over here? Look, come over here. Okay. And then we're going to make this like that. Yeah, we'll shorten up the distance there a little bit. And hopefully that'll be enough to get this tree to grow. We are two blocks away from it now. I think that might be okay. I mean, I guess we'll find out together if we're not. And then I can put this back over here so I can jump in. Okay, there we go. And get the wool. All right, perfect. So now hopefully that'll grow. We shorten that up a little bit. All right, we're taking care of business around here. That's how you do it. All right, so let's go over here and get some of this. Now, if you remember, when we built this crazy thing over here, this is kind of empty underneath here, I think, if I remember correctly. So what we need to do is we need to go... Can I see down there? Here, let's get rid of this block now. Well, that's all like hanging out in space, isn't it? Okay, that's okay, though. All right, so where is... We know that this is the right level. Okay, so we have to start filling in underneath this. We should have did it right the first time. I mean, I don't know what else to do. I mean, we could do the old bucket of water over the side trick. Yeah, we could probably do that, though. Like, put the bucket of water right there. Oh, there is some right there. Yeah, I want to get down low, because we have to protect all this dirt. We can't just be breaking it and hope we collect it. We have to make it so it doesn't go carting off into the void. So let's find our bucket right here. And then we'll come really quickly and just grab... This might cause an issue with my farm, but whatever. We'll grab that. We'll get some blocks on our bar. Then we'll come over here like so. Okay, put this right here like this. All right, and then we're going to jump in. And we're just going to go down here a little ways. And we'll break and go like, like this. Okay, there we go. And then we can get back up here just like that. And we can grab this again, and then we can take it over here, and we can put it back in there. Okay, didn't even know that it was unwaterlogged. And then we could jump down here like so, and we can build out underneath all of this dirt. Okay? Because we really can't afford any of our dirt to get lost. Yes, we want to build... Oh, I was like, what is that? We're going to build all under this like so. Okay. Actually, we had done pretty good. It wasn't too bad. We had most of it covered. And then we could just break this so we don't have a mob spawning down here. And this can all go flinging out into the void. Yes. Yes. Okay. We can go like so. And we should be able to reach down and break it all. Yep. Okay. And then break this. Okay. One more. 
And then we can put another ring out here like this. <laughs> One of you guys left a comment in the comment section that since I have unlimited cobblestone now, don't be like getting, uh, don't be going crazy and uh, having these one wide pathways. I understand, I'll, I'll be better about it this time. Don't worry, let's eat all these melons up really quick. It's awesome. Okay, so we have a couple seeds here. We're gonna take these. I mean, I know that we've already kinda... Okay, so we're gonna take all of those. And I guess, I mean, I, I wish we had more. I don't have a shovel. Do I not have a shovel? Did I put it away, maybe? Hmm, I have maybe never made a shovel. We haven't really needed one. All right, so let's go like this. We'll use this piece of cobblestone. There we go, okay? All right, so we're gonna harvest all of these. This is gonna give us some dirt. Okay, that's however many, 12. All right. And then I can take this dirt. I mean, we could take all of these. Oh, yeah, that's a, that's a great idea. We could take all of these two. Right? Uh, yeah. Yeah. All right, so we could take all of these. We'll break this. All right, so this, all these gangs, things have places to grow. And now we have 17 dirt. I mean, that's not too bad. I, we really need more than that. But this will be a good starter. And somewhere, I think I have a piece of, like... Uh, grass yeah right there so we got to protect that as well all right so i think what we should do just just so we're not repeating the same mistakes that we just almost did across the way there do i have any more cobblestone over here no all right let's sleep let's go over there and put a let's raise it up one it doesn't really matter right i don't care if it's raised up one but i'd rather be able to reclaim some of these resources oh we could just use these yeah how about we do that we'll be able to reclaim some of these resources as opposed to just having them being gone forever okay one two three four do I have any more of those nope all right we'll get these now i'm gonna have to do a little bit of concrete grind in here in just a minute but that's okay i don't mind and I hope that our tree will grow now. Come on, tree. You could do it. And then we go like that. One, two, three. Okay, so now, if we start here in the middle, we'll go like in the middle of this place and put down our one grass block. And then we'll go out around it. Yeah, and then we'll do like one, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. One. Oh, like that. I mean, that. hopefully that'll be big enough to spawn some animals and some stuff like that. I feel like we should uh, we should make a fence around this thing. I mean, we're eventually going to bring it all the way out to here. So maybe we can... Uh, I mean, I don't know. Just Maybe it's just like good enough right there for now. I mean, we're going to try to get more dirt. I'm not sure how to get more dirt, but man, I need some. I wish there was a way. There's not like, by the way, like a... There's no like crafting recipe there's coarse dirt yeah which we know how to make but that's the only dirt recipe that we have okay coarse dirt what is this is this oh nature okay and then we have these we do have this chicken thing hmm i don't know what to do now we have this extra wool chicken do we want to put the wool chicken over there and see if those guys can breed with the wool chicken at all if not we'll pick it up and move it somewhere here get in there oh he's got to go on this egg Oh, that thing burnt me. Okay. Wow, that thing is no joke. Here, you know what, guy? You are not going to be causing any trouble with me. There, pick that guy up, and you can go in there. Okay. All right, so that's cool. So now we have a second wool chicken, potentially. Look, we have a sheep already. We have some sheep over here, man. Oh, yeah. We need some natural chicken spawns. All right, so that worked like a dream. Literally, we have a sheep. Don't, hey, don't. No, we can't have sheep over here. I'm sorry. I know that sounded seems kind of hardcore, but he's gonna eat my one piece of grass I have. Okay, I need I need to do, I have to I have to protect the grass at all costs. <laughs> put put that right there. I don't think he'll be, able, he'll be able to eat that. It'll still be able to spread though. Oh my goodness, that was almost a disaster. The sheep almost ate it. Oh, our tree grew. All right, okay. So here's what I'm gonna do. This makes me really happy that this grew. I am going to. I'm just gonna be. Uh, I think I really would like some more dirt. Let's uh, let's do take this, and let's take this and this. How many is that? Four more. Let's put one of these back. We have that fire chicken in our inventory. Put one of these back, okay? 
That guy can grow there. Yeah, and let's just uh, add these three more dirt. We might as well. Okay, now our grass is growing. That's awesome. We got to be careful to sheep still. So now we have that. So that's a pretty good little little area. We'll fill in these corners like so, and then we'll figure out what we're going to do. Get some more cobblestone and go around, whatever. So, or maybe, maybe wood. I don't know. All right, so I'm going to chop down this tree now. We've done some good work. It, it's been a little, I mean, I feel like we've been messing around for a little bit, but we went over there and searched around, and then we reclaimed some of our dirt and got ourselves a little spawning pad over there. I'm going to chop this tree down. I'm going to try to stop jumping up and down because I know that burns through my hunger. Oh, there's my little guy. Oh, he's so cute. All right, All right there's a chicken token. Okay. Uh, so that guy is now right there. Can we uh, give him stuff to grow? Oh, it doesn't look like it. Okay, we have to wait. So I'm going to chop this tree down. I'm going to see if I get anything cool to spawn. If I do, I'll bring you guys back immediately. In the meantime, I'm going to grab a bunch of wood, and then I'm just going to finish out this area over here, make it so it looks like it's awesome looking. I right, get a fence going around there to protect it from bad guys, maybe get a couple torches happening, and then hopefully we get some more spawns. I'll see you in just a second. I'm also really going to try really hard to quit jumping up and down. Dang game. All right, see you in just a second. I've been doing a little bit of work around the base, nothing too major, but I've got myself a nice little pen over here, and we just collected a brand new chicken, a grass chicken. It just spawned naturally, and uh, we had four wool chickens. We seem to have a bunch of these wool chickens. I don't know why we have so many. Uh, I wish they weren't really wool chickens. We might have to, you know, get some food sources going on there. Uh, but I made this three wide just because I'm trying to listen to the comments and people in the comments don't like it when we go running around on these one wide areas. Wow, there's so many bad guys up there. It's uh, kind of ridiculous. Uh, we're not going to worry about that. But I'm bringing this grass chicken over here, and I wanted to bring you guys back because we're going to try to breed it with what we've got in here. I'm going to try to breed it maybe with the cobblestone chicken. All right, he goes down there. Let's do this. Let's go uh, this guy and this guy. Oh, so okay, something's gonna happen. Something's gonna happen. The Taiga Island. Oh, we got the Taiga Island. Where's it at? Oh, it's over there. Oh, look at all that dirt. Oh, it's, uh, we got stacks of dirt over there. That's awesome. Do we get an egg too? Oh, right here. Uh, sp oh, spruce chicken. Okay. All right, we'll go put that thing in our thing. That's awesome that we've got the Taiga. So breeding. So if you didn't know, breed, we have to get a grass chicken to spawn naturally, which is what we did. So him plus cobblestone, grass plus cobblestone, gives us the taiga chicken, or the spruce chicken, sorry. So again, grass plus cobblestone gives us a spruce chicken, which he already hatched already. Spruce log chicken uh, collected. And that unlocks the taiga island. Oh, yeah. And I can't remember what it was. Cobblestone and sand? I guess cobblestone and sand gave us uh, the sand island. Maybe that's not true. Mahaku will leave a comment and tell us for sure. She's got a spreadsheet going, I heard. <laughs> Mahaku's the best. All right, here we go. By the way, if you don't know who Mahaku is, uh, she's my number one mod in my community. All right, so we have to get over there. There's probably some goodies over there. There's lots of dirt. That's what we really need because then we can expand this area and then we can get a fully functioning farm. So I think that should probably be our next course of action. I mean, I think what we're going to do... Do you remember... Uh, what's that mod pack that we played? A marketplace map that we played that had all the different islands and then whenever an island would spawn, we would just go to destroy it. We would tear it all down. I think that this might be one of those type of deals. Is that what we're supposed to do here? Like, get all the goodies off of it and then just make it, like, our own little island? I mean, we could definitely do that. Hmm. Yeah. I wonder if there's, like, chickens that spawn only on that island, though, and we should leave it. Hmm. Let's just go harvest some dirt from this and not just tear the whole thing down to the ground. Look, we have more chickens spawning over here. This is pretty awesome. This is going to be a good food source for us, too. Uh, we don't need an... Oh, we probably do need a second redstone sand chicken. All right, let's bring him with us. There we go. We'll put him over here in the pen as well, or somewhere. I don't know where we'll need to start putting these chickens. We're starting to get um, a bunch of them, so he can be in there too. All right, these guys need to grow up, so we just need to see if we get more. All right, so I think what we're going to do is we're just going to go over there. We're going to just, I'm literally just going to bridge uh, across. We're going to make a platform underneath of it, maybe a couple steps up, make a platform underneath of it, and then we'll take, uh, we'll get a bunch of dirt from there, and we'll make a fully functioning. We still, maybe there's water up there. You think there's water? That would be amazing if we could get some water. Uh, we only have one bucket. But then hopefully we can make ourselves our own, uh, like a, uh, our own thing. Our own, 
like it, uh, like a, what is it? <laughs> oh, Deadcraft! Oh my goodness! Or right, like a, a, a farm, a farm. I planted the potatoes right there. A farm that we could grow all the resources that we need. So I'm gonna take the rest of my cobblestone and I'm gonna turn it into those. I'm probably gonna have to go harvest a bunch of cobblestone. Let me do this. Let me go over there and build the platform, and then we'll climb up on top of that together. We'll check it out and we'll see if there's anything awesome over there. We we'll have to make sure that we sleep through the night before we get over there, so no mobs will spawn, and then maybe we can at least chop down all the trees and get some free loots from there deal all right i'll see you in just a second it didn't take too long to build that little platform over there I actually even had a little bit of extra cobblestone but i just came back and grabbed a little bit more because i want to pillar up there and we're going to investigate this thing together i'm getting tons of chickens to spawn over there i think we're just going to start chopping them i believe um i did breed the grass chickens a minute ago and i have a little baby grass chicken running around uh he's right there he's loving it we're gonna try to get uh, that's gonna be a good way for us to get free grass going on around here look at that we got three already but let's go investigate this place over here and then we'll see what goodies it has to offer if anything so i just built this this came that came out there from that edge and i made it so it's big enough that if i want to chop or get the dirt from here i think i probably can this might need to go yeah this could probably go maybe even two do i have enough blocks i probably don't even have enough blocks to go all the way Let's not waste them. Okay. We'll go like that and like that and like that. I have to save one. Let me see. Uh, yeah, we're going to use this one. All right, we'll put that one down like that. And then I've got these cobblestone here. We're going to pillar all the way up until we hit this dirt block above our heads. Like that. Yep. And then we're going to just break that. And then we're going to go up and we're hoping for water up here. Water would be amazing. Okay, no water. There's some berries. I mean, okay. I mean, we got a couple things up here. Got some ferns. Got some podzel. Got some trees. Okay, this is not like super crazy stuff. Okay, we'll grab those. That'll give us some extra food source. We'll grab uh, these over here. Okay. So, oh, we have these. Okay, so we have uh, eight berries. We can plant those. That'll give us a little bit of a food source. I mean, so this this island, I don't know. I guess maybe the things are supposed to spawn up here. Is that the deal? I think we're going to use it mainly for dirt. <laughs> I mean, I don't know. I'm going to wait until you guys tell me one way or the other in the comment section if I should just tear this thing down or there's some special crazy chicken that spawns up here that I don't ever want to uh, not have. But I think what I'm going to do, we're going to leave most of it there, but I am going to snag a bunch of this free dirt right here that's just kind of hanging around because we want to increase our crop situation for sure. All right, can I go over there a little bit? Yeah, let's actually build our way over there. And we'll just use our shovel and snag up the rest of this. And then this will be plenty for what we need to do. We'll be able to fill out maybe our little area over there where the chickens are spawning, make it just a little bit bigger, but most importantly, see if we can't make our area for... Uh, our crops uh, so more substantial because I did get that potato from that guy that we killed the other day um, So I do have a potato so I can that'll be a nice food source. We can cook those up We can get a bunch of those going and we can uh, uh, Cook them in the furnace and then have baked potatoes, which is a decent food source for especially early game All right, let's get the rest of these knocked down really quick and then we'll go pick them all up and see how much we end up. I mean, that's fine. We don't need to go all crazy and destroy the entire island. I knew that was a mistake as soon as I broke it. But let's grab up all of these. Oh, yeah. And there's a ton more up there. So if you guys say that you think I can tear down this island, we definitely will. And then we're going to have even more dirt. And that'll essentially be all the dirt we'll probably ever need. Because, you know, once we get a nice spawning area. I mean, that gave us, oh, man, we have so much. <laughs> it gave us over a stack. Oh, that's money. We'll be able to get a massive crop farm going. Maybe even get a, a larger, I mean, I would maybe need to come over here and get a little bit more dirt at some point in the near future. Oh, that's, uh, because I want to get a bigger melon farm going that way i can have a steady supply of seeds i don't ever have to worry about seeds to do all the breeding that i need to do all right um i do want to try speaking of breeding i bred the grass chicken and the cobblestone chicken let's do grass chicken plus red sand chicken and see if anything happens okay nothing happened there let's just wait a second then we'll do a grass plus wool and we'll see if that any of that stuff works okay get out of here all right, so now I have tons more dirt. Makes me pretty happy. Let's go over here really quick. I think, though, I don't care about any of these. Oh, that's actually a dirt chicken. Yeah, the old dirt chicken collected. All right, that's kind of cool. 
Oh, did I get him? Yeah. All right, and these guys, yeah, these guys are just going to get, uh, you know, you know, they get what, what's coming to them. <laughs> All right, let's get this over here, and we'll just add, take that out, that out, this out, and grab this. And we'll put dirt in these four corners. That works. Perfect. Okay. So now we have a nice little spawning area there, uh, and I think we're in pretty good shape. So I, the only thing that I want to do now, just to finish up this episode, we're getting kind of long. I think first episode was uh, super long. I just want to make my figure out, I wish I mean, if there was some water. Oh, man, I would love just to have a little bit of water. I don't know how to get any. There's not like a, I don't think there's a way. We're going to have to unlock another type of chicken. I have a feeling, though. Oh, let's, uh, let's do that really quick. Let's try this wool plus grass. Okay, nothing's happening there. All right. All right. Um, I could take one of these. Okay, and we can bring him over here. And we could put him like so. And we could try this and this. Okay, that didn't do anything. Okay. And we have this dirt chicken. And we just put the dirt chicken over here. And this dirt chicken, we could do this. What's this? No. Are there any more seeds? Uh, yep. Yeah. Okay. So let's do... Uh, oh, I need wheat. Let's not use up all of our wheat. Let's use this. Okay. So let's do cobblestone. Oh, no. I didn't want to do that. Great. Now I've done a spruce chicken. All right. I mean, that's okay. All right. So I'm just going to spend a little bit of time and expand my little crop area here. I don't know. I think... I mean, I don't, I don't, maybe I should, I don't really need to do that as of yet. I mean, we got some new chickens today, that's for sure. We got that little spruce guy. We got that thing over there. That's pretty cool. We got that stuff going on over there, which is awesome. I mean, maybe we don't need to expand our area here. I mean, I guess we can a little bit. Let's just go ahead and build what we can build here. Right, we just have to be able to stand down in there. Okay. And this has to be, uh, one, two, three, four. Nope, one too many. Like so. Okay. Now that's that's back. We'll grab this back up here. All right, so now if I get this going over here, I can go and we can just till up all of that. That is going to be there, there, uh, there, 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 like so. All right, and then I can plant my wheat back in here. One, two, nope. My wheat. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Plant all that, and then I can put my potato somewhere, too. My potato can go, like, right there. Perfect. Now, uh, once I get water, we'll redesign this whole thing, and we'll have an awesome, like, crop area where we're growing all the crops. We'll also make ourselves a dedicated melon area, which I think is going to be pretty key. Uh, I think what we need to do, there's donkeys over there. We don't need those. I think we just need to uh, figure out what the next steps are as far as breeding. I mean, we could do, uh, we could probably do this really quick. Okay, I don't have any more seeds. Hmm, that's okay. All right, so none of those combinations work. We'll have to keep figuring some of that stuff out. Anyway, we'll do that next time. If you have any suggestions on what we should do around here, please let me know. We did good work today. We got ourselves to Tiger Island. We got a bunch of new chickens. We fixed that spot over there. We did all kinds of awesome stuff. Until next time, please remember to be cool. Don't be a fool. And from my Chicken Blocked Let's Play series, I guess we'll see you next time. Bye, everybody.